Good evening, everybody. Buenas noches con todos. Y tonight, we begin our novena to the Holy Spirit. And uh, I'm excited for this. I think it's going to be a just a really fruitful time. It's going to be a combination of catechesis, but also of encounter. And that's what we desire. We want to grow in knowledge of our faith. And at the same time, um, the whole point of, of coming to know our faith is to have a deeper communion and union with God um, through the power of the Holy Spirit. So that's going to be our goal. Um, we're starting tonight, and we will finish at the Vigil of Pentecost with an outpouring of the Holy Spirit. We're going to pray that people actually receive like what we call almost like a baptism of the Holy Spirit. And so it should be a very powerful time. Again, we're going to invite you to invite your family and friends to join us for these nine days. If they're not here tonight, okay, every night we can kind of build up as we did with the Novena of Light and uh, spread the word uh, for how this will work. I'll explain in just a moment uh, after a few words in Spanish. Bienvenido con todos. Eh, ya comenzamos nuestra novena en el Espíritu Santo. Queremos que eso sea una buena combinación de catequesis en, en quién es el Espíritu Santo y cómo funciona el Espíritu Santo en nuestra vida de fe, pero también queremos que eso sea un tiempo de encuentro con la presencia del Espíritu Santo, eh, porque esa es, esa es la meta de nuestro conocimiento, es, es llevarnos a un encuentro más profundo con el Señor a través del poder del Espíritu Santo. Entonces, cada noche vamos a tener predicación en un elemento, un perspective eh, sobre el Espíritu Santo. Eh, so that each night we're going to have preaching connected to some element of or one part of the work of the Holy Spirit in our life of faith. And so we hope this is fruitful for you. Uh, we invite you to invite your family and friends to come join us for this uh, special novena. And if they're not here tonight, it's okay. We can grow and, and maybe grow each night, bringing more and more people aboard so they can benefit from a deeper knowledge and encounter with the Holy Spirit. And then we'll have that special event on the Pentecost Vigil, uh, which should be a great night, a night of fire, as we're calling it. So more information to come. Um, and thanks for tuning in. Um, tonight, just as a preview, we'll be, I'll be talking about the gifts and fruits of the Holy Spirit, the seven gifts and the 12 fruits of the Holy Spirit. Hoy noche, eh, en, en el tiempo de predicación, voy a hablar sobre los siete dones y doce frutos del Espíritu Santo. Eso viene ya esa noche. Okay, and like always, we're going to have our exposition of the Blessed Sacrament and our rosary. Now, eh, just a little uh, direction. If you go onto our Facebook, you'll see that pinned to the top is um, an explanation of the prayers of the Novena to the Holy Spirit. This novena has actually um, two parts to it. Some are prayers that are consistent all nine nights, but then there are different prayers connected to each of the nine nights. We're taking the English one from EWTN's website under the Novena to the Holy Spirit. So you can find it there. You'll see the link in our post on the top of the Facebook page. But also we will print out or we will paste into the post every night the entire prayer for the night. So feel free to find that when we get to the prayer for the Holy Spirit, which we will pray um, after the preaching, okay? And the way we're going to do it, as we've been doing um, since their longer prayers, this novena is longer, um, it's not a short prayer, and they're not word for word in English and Spanish like it was with the novena of light. So one night we'll pray the prayer in English here live, and then another night we'll pray in Spanish here live. But you can, of course, follow along in your own language right there from our Facebook page, or if you want to go right to EW10's website and follow it through the nine days while you're with another device while you're watching the rosary. Um, however, uh, you find it easiest. So I'm going to say that in Spanish. Eh, la forma que vamos a utilizar es, tenemos nosotros, si tú veas en nuestro Facebook, como apegado al tope de página de los posts, es la novena del Espíritu Santo. Primero en inglés y abajo en español. Y, y estamos leyendo una oración cada noche, después la predica, predicación que viene después del rosario, y una noche en inglés, otra noche en español, y viceversa. Y vamos tornando así, pero tú, vamos a ponerlo cada noche, la oración de cada noche aquí en nuestro Facebook. Eh, eh, tú vas a ver que eh, está ahí escrito en español, y, y la oración tiene dos elementos, las oraciones que rezamos todos los días, pero también cada día tiene su propia oración del día por los nueve días. Si tú quieres seguirlo, hemos uh, sacado esta novena 
de la página de ACI Prensa, que es una uh, página de eh, periódico en español por cosas católicas. Ahí hay, hay novenas y hemos sacado esa novena eh, eh, de esta página de web. So, este enlace también es en, es en la post que está postado ahí en la página de Facebook. So, tú puedes aplastarlo y ver como los nueve días o también tú puedes ver nuestro Facebook. Cada día vamos a poner eh, la oración del día. Okay? Si quiere imprimirles en su computadora, está bien. If you feel easier to print it on your computer, that's fine too. So, okay, I, um, I know it's just a little complicated, but you'll see, just for example, um, they're printed on the top of our web page. There's the Novena in English, and then also the Novena in Spanish. And you'll, you'll should be able to find out and follow along. Or if you just want to listen in, that's fine too. Or solo se quiere como escuchar, está bien también. Okay. So with that, we'll now begin uh, reading our list of intentions, and uh, thank you for your presence. Y ya vamos a leer la lista de intenciones, y gracias por su presencia esa noche. So, we begin now with our list uh, of those who are sick, and we pray now for Hilda, Rosie Kuhn's husband, who had surgery today, baby Jeremiah, Juan, Carmelo, Hilda and Fausto, George, Jacqueline, Delia, Silvia, Tata, Donna, Joanne, Rosanna, Maria's father, Myra, Edwin, Tomas, Priscilla, Eusebio, Nicole, Rafaela, Eva, Travis, Suleika, Gloria, Levardo, Marta, Josie, Gustavo, Nini, Padre Sosin, Felicita, Gloria, Carolina, Nick, Rosa, Maria, Julie, Agustin, Veronica, Asuncion, Jacqueline and Anna, Maria, Ethan, Rosa, Marta, Betty, Raquel, Juan Carlos, Sulma, Aspasia, and many, many more who've asked for our prayers. We ask that you would keep all the sick in your prayers as we go forward. Y muchos más que nos han pedido sus oraciones. Nos pedimos que mantengan sus oraciones todos los enfermos. We pray for the souls, por las almas de todos los defuntos. Uh, we remember Jose Quiñones y Delfina Troya de Quiñones, Margaret Martín, Hugo Fucci, Victor Bruno, Jorge Carrera, Victor Garcia, Daniel Shea, Adriana Costas, Ana Marmalejos, Benito Vera, Aurea, Carmen Morel, Francisco Peralta, Luis Gonzalez, Dania Cusa, Phil Foglia, Pablo Rodriguez, Maria Natividad Leon de Leon Peña, Viviano Emmy Nunez, Anthony Das, who was buried today, who went to Holy Cross School as a child, Rafaela Goche, Gocochea, Will, Esperanza Diaz de Guerra, Jose Padron, Josefina Salinas, Hector Mota, Deacon Roberto Fernandez, Marta Vele, Luis Rivera, Tony Cardona, Yasmina Silveria, Silverio, Consuelo Rosario, Cindy Summers, Ramona Rodriguez, Robert Cardona, Irma Medina, Domingo Gomez Rivera, Aiden Guzman, Minerva de Jesus, Esther Morales, Pablo Antonio Julguin, Selena, Edgar Moya Checa, Horacio Diaz Valerio, Dolores Burgos, Gracie Wilkie, Victor Prandom, Michael Moratore, Teodoro Vega, Luis Rodriguez, Judy Lopez, Ramon Espinal, Magdi Bulos, Priscilla, Pedro Luis Aguiar, Jose Antonio Colón, Celeste Rodriguez, Margarita Cruz Reyes, Virginia Acabeo, Adelia Vargas, Emma Fontanes, Luisito, Luis Vega, Robert Strickland Sr., Pedro Martín Vidal, Ellen, Seneda Cabrera, Rafael Veras. We pray for other needs. We continue to pray for all the hospital staff and chaplains and paramedics. One in particular named Jessica asked for prayers tonight as she goes back to work in the hospital and many of our prisoners who work in hospitals. We ask God's graces and healing and protection for them as they go in and put themselves at risk for the good of others. We think of our friend Leslie too from the parish and so many of you who have friends in the hospitals, we ask for their protection. We pray for Richard and Josue, Jessica, 
to this and newborn baby girl, Dominga Espinal Reynoso, Paula, Jose, Jesus, Moises, Melgabar, Ramona, Anthony's family, children affected by COVID, Sila, Jasmine, Marilyn, Elizabeth, y family, Rafael, Carolina, and esposo, and Josh. And uh, también he mencionado los que están trabajando en los hospitales, incluyendo nuestros propios feligreses, por su propia protección. And we've been praying also for these uh, safe pregnancies for Maha, Priscilla, Alexandra, Andraina, Maricela, Natalie, Gracie, Celine, Justine, Stellan, Ivalise, Eridania, Basha, Rosali, Ashley, Stefania, Veronica, Ayana, Tiffany, Ingrid, and Heather. So for these and all of our other special intentions that we hold in our hearts, por ellos y todas nuestras intenciones especiales que guardamos en la silencio de nuestros corazones. Now we begin. O salutaris hostia, which elipanis o hostium, de la primun hostilia, da rover ferranzilium, unitrino quedominum. Sid sempiterna gloria, qui vitam sine termino, nobis donet in patria. Amen. Heavenly Father, we praise you, we thank you, and we love you. Dear Jesus, you're so good. You're so good. You're so close to us, closer than we are to even ourselves, closer than our skin. You are here inside of us, Lord, by the power of the Holy Spirit. We thank you, Jesus. And we're praying now in these nine days for a special outpouring of the Holy Spirit on the face of the earth, but in a special way upon all those who will pray in this novena and for their loved ones to renew us, Lord, to refresh us, to heal what's broken inside of us and just to make us new, Jesus, for you can make all things new by the power and the grace of the Holy Spirit. Te alabamos, te glorificamos. Te amamos, Señor, te damos gracias, Señor Jesús. Jesús, tú eres tan cerca de nosotros, tan cerca, más cerca de nuestra propia respiración, más cerca de nuestros mismos, porque eres adentro, en nuestra alma, en la más profunda en nuestro corazón. Vive, Señor, por el poder del Espíritu Santo. En estos días estamos aclamando al cielo, pidiendo que abre las puertas del cielo para enviar su Espíritu Santo, renovar la faz de la tierra, comenzando con nuestros corazones, especialmente los que rezarán esta santa novena al Espíritu Santo, para iniciar en nosotros algo nuevo, renovarnos, sanarnos, liberarnos de tantas cosas que necesitamos, Señor. En el nombre de Jesucristo nuestro Señor. Amén. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Creo en Dios, Padre Todopoderoso, Creador del cielo y de la tierra. Creo en Jesucristo, su único Hijo, nuestro Señor, que fue concebido por obra y gracia del Espíritu Santo. Nació de Santa María Virgen, padeció bajo el poder del Poncio Pilato, fue crucificado, muerto y sepultado. Descendió a los infiernos, al tercer día resucitó entre los muertos, Subió a los cielos y está sentado a la derecha del Dios Padre. Desde allí ha de venir a buscar a vivos y muertos. Creo en el Espíritu Santo, la Santa Iglesia Católica, la comunión de los santos, el perdón de los pecados, y la resurrección de la carne y la vida eterna. Amén. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. For an increase in the graces of faith, hope, and charity. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Dios te salve, Maria, llena eres de gracia, Señor es contigo. 
Bendito tú eres entre todas las mujeres, y bendito es el fruto de tu vientre, Jesús. Santa María, Madre de Dios, rega por nosotros, pecadores, ahora y en la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria, Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. This Friday night we pray our sorrowful mysteries. We think of the first mystery is the prayer in the Garden of Gethsemane of Jesus. And we think of how his heart was so moved by the passion that he would endure. That blood from his heart flowed through his body, out his pores, as he poured out blood for us. Pensamos, Señor, como el corazón de Jesús en la huerta de Gethsemane estaba tan intenso, lleno de pasión, y también está, está sentimiento de intensidad, que su corazón se palpitó hasta la sangre, salió de, de su piel, el botó sangre por nosotros. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins. Save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria, Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. The fruit of the mystery is the pain of sin. El fruto del misterio es el dolor por el pecado. The second sorrowful mystery is the flagellation of the pillar. And perhaps just to get a little idea of the pain this must have caused when Jim Caviezel was filming The Passion of the Christ of Mel Gibson and they filmed the flagellation scene. They, they had a board over his back so 
as the actors playing the soldiers hit that board, it wouldn't hit his back. And then they used camera technology to make it look as if it was hitting his back. But at one of the times they missed, and just one shot of that element shot pain through his body that was excruciating. That was one. Imagine 40. Imaginamos la flagelación en cuando los productores de la película La Pasión de Cristo de Mel Gibson, el actor que jugaba el papel de Jesús era Jim Caviezel. En esta escena cuando ellos grabaron la flagelación, ellos utilizaban como ilusión para hacer el cámara a parecer que ellos estaban flagelándolo. Pero ellos tuvieran como un palo ahí sobre su, su espalda para bloquear eh, el, los azotes. Pero uno de ellos se, se equivocó con, con su dirección de su, su azote y, y se golpeó la espalda y no la par, la la palo. Y Jim Caviezel dijo que este dolor que, que entró su cuerpo era tan extremo. Imaginamos, eso es uno. Imaginamos 40. Padre nuestro que estás en el cielo, santificado sea tu nombre. Venga a nosotros reino, hágase tu voluntad en la tierra como en el cielo. Danos hoy nuestro pan de cada día, perdona nuestras ofensas como también nosotros perdamos a los que nos ofenden. No nos des caer en tentación y líbranos del mal. Amén. Dios te salve María, llena eres de gracia, el Señor es contigo. Bendita tú eres entre todas las mujeres, y bendito es el fruto de tu vientre Jesús. Santa María, Madre de Dios, rega por nosotros pecadores, ahora y en la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Dios te salve María, llena eres de gracia, el Señor es contigo. Bendita tú eres entre todas las mujeres, y bendito es el fruto del vientre de Jesús. Santa María, Madre de Dios, rega por nosotros pecadores, ahora y en la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Dios te salve María, y en eres de gracia, el Señor es contigo. Bendita tú eres entre todas las mujeres, y bendito es el fruto del vientre de Jesús. Santa María, Madre de Dios, rega por nosotros pecadores, ahora y en la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Dios te salve María, llena eres de gracia, el Señor es contigo. Bendita tú eres entre todas las mujeres, y bendito es el fruto del vientre de Jesús. Santa María, Madre de Dios, rega por nosotros pecadores, ahora y en la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Dios te salve María, llena eres de gracia, el Señor es contigo. Bendita tú eres entre todas las mujeres, y bendito es el fruto de tu vientre de Jesús. Santa María, Madre de Dios, rega por nosotros pecadores, ahora y en la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Dios te salve María, llena eres de gracia, el Señor es contigo. Bendita tú eres entre todas las mujeres, y bendito es el fruto de tu vientre Jesús. Santa María, Madre de Dios, rega por nosotros pecadores, ahora y en la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Dios te salve María, llena eres de gracia, el Señor es contigo. Bendita tú eres entre todas las mujeres, y bendito es el fruto de tu vientre Jesús. Santa María, Madre de Dios, rega por nosotros pecadores, ahora y en la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Dios te salve María, llena eres de gracia, el Señor es contigo. Bendita tú eres entre todas las mujeres, y bendito es el fruto de tu vientre Jesús. Santa María, Madre de Dios, Rega por nosotros pecadores, ahora y en la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Dios te salve María, llena eres de gracia, el Señor es contigo. Bendita tú eres entre todas las mujeres, y bendito es el fruto de tu vientre, Jesús. Santa María, Madre de Dios, rega por nosotros pecadores, ahora y en la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Dios te salve María, llena eres de gracia, el Señor es contigo. Bendita tú eres entre todas las mujeres, y bendito es el fruto de tu vientre, Jesús. Santa María, Madre de Dios, rega por nosotros pecadores, ahora y en la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Gloria al Padre, gloria al Hijo, gloria al Espíritu Santo, como en el principio ahora y siempre, por los siglos de los siglos. Amén. María es Madre de Gracia, Madre de Misericordia, en la vida y en la muerte, amparanos, Gran Señora. 
Oh Jesús mío, perdona nuestras culpas en pecados. Líbranos en fuego del infierno y lleva al cielo todas las almas, especialmente la más necesitada de tu infinita misericordia. Amén. Ave, ave, ave María, ave, ave, ave María. El fruto del misterio es la pureza. The fruit of the mystery is purity. The third sorrowful mystery is the crowning of thorns. Perhaps each time we meditate on the mysteries, we think of maybe one little aspect or detail that's different about this mystery. And tonight we might consider what it would be like to be Jesus, so humiliated. Not just the pain of excru excruciating pain of thorns going into your head, but the humiliation to be the king of the universe and spat upon. Esa noche podemos pensar en la humillación de Jesús. No solo el dolor de los espinas en su cabeza y cráneo, sino la humillación de ser el reino del universo eh, para recibir la saliva de los soldados en su cara por sus, escupando a él. Our Father, who art in heaven, Hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria, Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. The fruit of the mystery is courage. The fruit of the mystery is valor. The fourth sorrowful mystery Jesus carries is cross. We can imagine what it would have been like to be surrounded by a yelling crowd, your body already brutalized by the flagellation, your head screaming with pain from the coronation, and then a cross that weighed about 200 pounds on your back, falling under its heavy weight three times at least, 
and being humiliated along the way. Por imaginar cómo sería llevar una cruz en una ciudad llena de gente gritando y burlando sobre ti, con tu espalda ya como en palazos por esta flagelación, con una cabeza gritando con dolor por la coronación, ya cargando una cruz de 200 libres aproximadamente, cayendo tres veces por lo menos, en completamente miseria y humillación. Padre nuestro que estás en el cielo, santificado sea tu nombre. Venga a nosotros tu reino, hágase tu voluntad en la tierra como en el cielo. Danos hoy nuestro pan de cada día, perdona nuestras ofensas, como también nosotros perdonamos a los que nos ofenden. No nos descaiga en la tentación y líbranos del mal. Amén. Jesús es condenado a la muerte. Dios te salve María, llena eres de gracia, el Señor es contigo. Bendita tú eres entre todas las mujeres. Y bendito es el fruto de tu vientre Jesús. Santa María, Madre de Dios, rega por nosotros pecadores. Ahora y en la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Dios te salve María, llena eres de gracia, el Señor es contigo. Bendita tú eres entre todas las mujeres. Y bendito es el fruto de tu vientre Jesús. Santa María, Madre de Dios, rega por nosotros pecadores, ahora y en la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Jesús carga su cruz y se caí primera vez. Dios te salve María, llena eres de gracia, el Señor es contigo. Bendita tú eres entre todas las mujeres, y bendito es el fruto de tu vientre Jesús. Santa María, Madre de Dios, rega por nosotros pecadores, ahora y en la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Jesús encontró a su madre en camino. Dios te salve María, llena eres de gracia, el Señor es contigo. Bendita tú eres entre todas las mujeres, y bendito es el fruto del vientre de Jesús. Santa María, Madre de Dios, rega por nosotros pecadores, ahora y en la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Simón ayuda a Jesús a cargar su cruz. Dios te salve María, llena eres de gracia, el Señor es contigo. Bendita tú eres entre todas las mujeres. Y bendito es el fruto de tu vientre, Jesús. Santa María, Madre de Dios, rega por nosotros, pecadores, ahora y en la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Verónica enjugó el rostro de Jesús. Dios te salve, María, llena eres de gracia, el Señor es contigo. Bendita tú eres entre todas las mujeres, y bendito es el fruto de tu vientre, Jesús. Santa María, Madre de Dios, rega por nosotros, pecadores, Ahora y en la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Jesús caí por segunda vez. Dios te salve María, llena eres de gracia, el Señor es contigo. Bendita tú eres entre todas las mujeres. Y bendito es el fruto del vientre Jesús. Santa María, Madre de Dios, rega por nosotros pecadores. Ahora y en la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Jesús encontró las hijas de Jerusalén para consolarles. Dios te salve, María, llena eres de gracia, el Señor es contigo. Bendita tú eres entre todas las mujeres, y bendito es el fruto de tu vientre, Jesús. Santa María, Madre de Dios, rega por nosotros, pecadores, ahora y en la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Jesús, caí por te serves, Dios te salve, María, llena eres de gracia, el Señor es contigo. Bendita tú eres entre todas las mujeres, y bendito es el fruto de tu vientre, Jesús. Santa María, Madre de Dios, rega por nosotros, pecadores, ahora y en la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Jesús es despojado de su ropa. Dios te salve, María, llena eres de gracia, el Señor es contigo. Bendita tú eres entre todas las mujeres, y bendito es el fruto de tu vientre, Jesús. Santa María, Madre de Dios, rega por nosotros, pecadores, ahora y en la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Gloria al Padre, gloria al Hijo, gloria al Espíritu Santo, como en el principio, ahora y siempre, por los siglos de los siglos. Amén. María es Madre de gracia, Madre de misericordia, en la vida y en la muerte, amparanos, Gran Señora. Oh Jesús mío, perdona nuestras culpas y pecados, líbranos en fuego del infierno y lleva la cielo a todas las almas, especialmente las más necesitadas de tu infinita misericordia. Amén. Ave, ave, ave María. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. The fruit of the mystery is patience. El fruto del misterio es paciencia. The fifth sorrowful mystery is the crucifixion and death of our Lord. 
el quinto misterio doloroso de crucifixión y muerte de Jesús. And we can remember that at that time, Jesus hanging on the cross for three hours, dehydrated, asphyxiated, brutalized, humiliated, naked, gave everything he had, his final breath, and even the water and blood from his heart. And ahora meditamos como Jesús en la cruz, asfixiada, dehydrada, golpeada, humillada, coronada, y ya con nada, desnudo, ya dio todo su cuerpo, todo su alma, y también hasta el agua y sangre de su corazón. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Jesus is nailed to the cross. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Father, forgive them that know not what they do. I assure you this day, you'll be with me in paradise. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Woman, behold your son. Son, behold your mother. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. My God, my God, why hast thou forsaken me? I thirst. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. To thy hands, Lord, I commend my spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. And blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. It is finished. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. A lance pierced Jesus' heart, and blood and water flowed out. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And the body of Jesus was laid in the arms of his blessed mother. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. The fruit of the mystery is perseverance. The fruit of the mysterio is la perseverancia. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of mercy, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To thee do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping, in this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious advocate, thine eyes of mercy towards us. And after this, our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. 
Let us pray, O God, whose only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life. Grant, we beseech thee, that by meditating upon these mysteries of the Holy Rosary of the Most Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise. Through the same Christ, our Lord. Amen. We pray, one Our Father, one Hail Mary, and one glory be for the intentions of our Holy Father. Por los intenciones de Papa Francisco, Padre nuestro que estás en el cielo. Santificado sea tu nombre, venga a nosotros tu reino, hágase tu voluntad en la tierra como en el cielo. Danos hoy nuestro pan de cada día, perdona nuestras ofensas, como también nosotros. Pero oramos a los que nos ofenden, no nos descaigan en la tentación, y líbranos del mal. Amén. Dios te salve María, llena eres de gracia, el Señor es contigo. Bendita tú eres entre todas las mujeres, y bendito es el fruto del vientre de Jesús, Santa María. Madre de Dios, rega por nosotros pecadores ahora y en la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Gloria al Padre, y gloria al Hijo, y gloria al Espíritu Santo, como en el principio ahora y siempre, por los siglos de los siglos. Amén. St. Michael the Archangel, defend us in battle. Be your defense against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him. We humbly pray to thou, Prince of the Heavenly Host, by the power of God, thrust into hell Satan and all the evil spirits who prowl throughout the world, seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. We pray now our prayer that... Pope Francis is asking us to pray. Oremos una de las oraciones que Papa Francisco nos pidió orar. Oh María, tú resplandeces siempre en nuestro camino como un signo de salvación y esperanza. A ti nos encomendamos salud de los enfermos que al pie de la cruz fuiste asociada al dolor de Jesús. Manteniendo firme tu fe, tu salvación del pueblo romano, sabes lo que necesitamos. Estamos seguros de que lo concederás. ¿Para qué? Como en, Galilea, en Cana de Galilea, Vuelven a la alegría y la fiesta después de esta prueba. Ayúdanos, Madre de Divino Amor, a conformarnos a la voluntad del Padre y a hacer lo que Jesús nos dirá. Él, que tomó nuestro sufrimiento sobre sí mismo, se, se cargó de nuestros dolores para guiarnos a través de la cruz a la alegría de la resurrección. Amén. Bajo tu amparo nos acogemos, Santa Madre de Dios. No despreces nuestras súplicas en las necesidades. Antes bien, líbranos del todo peligro, oh Virgen gloriosa y bendita. Amén. Our Lady of Mount Carmel, pray for us. Our Lady of Fatima, pray for us. Our Lady of Lourdes, pray for us. Our Lady of Peace, pray for us. Our Lady of Ephesus, pray for us. Our Lady of Chestahova, pray for us. Our Lady of Akita, pray for us. Our Lady of Quebec, pray for us. Our Lady of Jerusalem, pray for us. Nuestra Señora de la Virgen de Cisne, rega por nosotros. Nuestra Señora de Alta Gracia, rega por nosotros. Nuestra Señora de la Merced, rega por nosotros. Nuestra Señora de Divina Providencia, rega por nosotros. Nuestra Señora de Rosario de Pozo, rega por nosotros. Nuestra Señora de Guadalupe, rega por nosotros. Our Lady of Good Hope, pray for us. Our Lady of Divine Love, pray for us. Our Lady of Help of Christians, pray for us. Our Lady of Health of the Sick, pray for us. Our Lady of Light, pray for us. Our Lady of Victory, pray for us. Our Lady of the Rosary, pray for us. Saint Joseph, pray for us. All you holy men and women, saints and souls, pray for us. Father, Son, Holy Spirit. Amen. Okay, everybody. So this night, I want to begin our preaching series on the gifts of the Holy Spirit, reading right from sacred scripture. And the, the theme is the fruits and gifts of the Holy Spirit. And we want to ask, where does that come from? Eh, esa noche quiero iniciar directamente nuestra novena en el Espíritu Santo. Y la tema de esa noche es los frutos y dones del Espíritu Santo. ¿Y de dónde vengan ellos? Actually, they actually come right out of our scriptures. So we can find most of them uh, in two places. So I'm just going to read those short verses. Okay, first from the book of Isaiah. And uh, I'll read um, one in English and one in Spanish. So from Isaiah chapter 11, the prophet Isaiah chapter 11. And if you look in verses 1 and 2, you hear these words. There shall come forth a shoot from the stump of Jesse, a branch shall grow out of his roots, and the spirit of the Lord shall rest upon him, a spirit of wisdom and understanding, a spirit of counsel and might, a spirit of knowledge and fear of the Lord, and his delight shall be in the fear of the Lord. Um, there we hear about the gifts of the Holy Spirit, which we're going to receive in confirmation. Aquí, in Isaías, uh, uh, capítulo 11, versículo 1 y 2, escuchemos sobre los 
dones del Espíritu Santo que recibiremos eh, en confirmación, o hemos recibido en confirmación. En, aquí es donde la iglesia saca los dones del Espíritu Santo, eh, eh, porque está hablando sobre eh, esta Mesías que viene, que va a tener como la, la acumulación de todos esos dones. And this is speaking of the Messiah who will come, who will have all of these gifts inside of him. And of course, we know this is Jesus, but he wants to share these with us. Okay, so now what about the fruits of the Holy Spirit, which we'll hear about? And I'm going to explain these things, but just to kind of get the scriptural references first. Um, and I'm going to read this one in Spanish, but just so you have it, if you go to Galatians, St. Paul's letter to the Galatians chapter 5, okay, verses 22 And 23, we hear not all 12 of the fruits, but you hear many of the fruits listed. I'm going to read that in Spanish. Por los frutos del Espíritu Santo, vamos por eh, el, la carta de San Pablo a los Galatas, okay, vers, eh, capítulo 5, versículos eh, 22 y 23. Ahí vamos a escuchar algunos de los frutos, no todos, pero um, un buen número de los frutos. Por el contrario, el fruto del Espíritu es amor, alegría, paz, paciencia, amabilidad, bondad, fidelidad, modestia y dominio propio. ¿Sí? So eso aquí es donde hay una referencia escritural de los dones del Espíritu Santo en Isías y los frutos del Espíritu Santo en Galatas. So there's our scriptural references for the gifts of the fruit of the Holy Spirit in Isaiah, and also the fruits of the Holy Spirit in Galatians. Now, I'd like to just speak a little bit about what are these? Well, we're going to start with the gifts. ¿Qué son esos dones? ¿Qué, qué significa esos dones? And what do they mean? Well, first of all, the church teaches that um, every sacrament contains an encounter or um, is, is really brought to the soul, the Jesus Christ and the presence of God is brought by the power of the Holy Spirit. So the Holy Spirit and meets us in every sacrament. And we know baptism is like where the, the seed of God's life in us begins. But at confirmation, the church teaches that we receive the seven gifts of the Holy Spirit. Wisdom, knowledge, counsel, fortitude, understanding, piety, and fear of the Lord. So just to kind of have a visual on that, I'm just going to show you a little visual here. So for those that maybe want to see from home, all right, there's our gifts of the Holy Spirit, right? Wisdom, piety, knowledge, understanding, counsel, fortitude, and fear of the Lord. Okay? Son siete dones, que son sabiduría, conocimiento, consejo, fortaleza, entendimiento, piedad, y también, eh, también el miedo del Señor. Okay? All right, so... What's the difference between these gifts? Well, some of them are very similar, but there's one way to understand it. Why are they given? They're given to us. Really, the church talks about in the Catechism of the Catholic Church, point 1831, right? El Catecismo de, de la, la Iglesia Católica, punto 1831. Eh, he, they use Thomas Aquinas, one of our great saints, who wrote a lot about uh, the gifts of the Holy Spirit. And they are to three main points is their purpose, to sustain the moral life, to complete and perfect the virtues, and also to allow us to be docile or students of the Holy Spirit. Hay tres puntos principales. Si vemos en el Catecismo de la Iglesia Católica, el punto 1831, eh, utiliza el esquema de San Tomás Aquino, que escribió mucho sobre los dones del Espíritu Santo, y los tres metas o tres eh, propósitos del Espíritu Santo, dones, son para sostener la vida moral, para cumplir y perfeccionar las virtudes y también dejarnos capaces de ser dóciles al Espíritu Santo o como discípulos o estudiantes del Espíritu Santo. So let's talk about this for just a minute. Well, there's wisdom, understanding, and knowledge, and they sound kind of similar, but I'm just going to give a, a little brief difference. Wisdom is really a gift that helps us to think deeply about ideas. So you might think of that as like depth of thought. Understanding is what allows us to be more aware and open to how others think and feel. So you might associate that with like compassion for others, right? And knowledge gives us 
the ability to make meaning of information, right? So we can think of wisdom as depth, understanding as compassion, and knowledge as like information plus. <laughs> and so that's one way to differentiate between these gifts that are given at confirmation. I'm going to say that in Spanish. Eh, hay tres dones que son, que son parecido, pero hay una distinción. Sabiduría es la capacidad de ayudarnos a pensar profundamente sobre ideas. Entendimiento es lo que nos hace más abierto y ayudarnos a dar cuenta cómo otros siente y piensa. Podemos en una palabra decir compasión. Y conocimiento nos ayuda a hacer significación de información. Son los tres dones que están parecidos. Sabería, podemos decir como profundidad de, 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 de meditación. Entendimiento, podemos decir compasión. Y por conocimiento podemos decir como información eh, plus, como hacer eh, significación de información. So this is having to do with our intellect. And in this end, it's beautiful that the Holy Spirit wants to perfect and improve our intellect. We say with St. Thomas Aquinas that grace builds upon our nature. So we're given a certain capacities from our, our genetic code, right? And our abilities or our IQ, but the Holy Spirit can bring us to reach the potential of our intellectual abilities and, and also our wisdom. So the Holy Spirit wants to do that. And this is actually bonita porque el don del Espíritu Santo, Dios quiere perfeccionar nuestras capacidades intelectuales. Eh, nosotros estamos nacidos con eh, capacidades ciertos por nuestro código genético y con talentos diferentes, pero cada quien tiene un potencial. Dios quiere perfeccionar nuestro, y ayudarnos a llegar a nuestro potencial en lo que es sabiduría, conocimiento y entendimiento. All right. Now, the next gifts. We have counsel, right? And that's very important. Many times people will come in need of some kind of direction. And it's up to us to be able to give counsel. And, and we want to give that from the power of the Holy Spirit, not just our own intellect. And so that's a gift that helps us to make right judgments, see? ¿sí? Eh, el consejo es, es el don para ayudarnos a dar como consejos a los demás. Cuando ellos nos piden, queremos que eso viene del Espíritu Santo, no solo de nuestro propio intelecto. Y también eso es como hacer juicio, pero correctamente. Uh, next, we have fortitude. Well, we need courage to resist fear. Fear often is used by the devil to impede us from doing the right thing or from, from, from living our life our spiritual life to the full. And one needs fortitude and courage to overcome that fear. And también el otro es fortaleza. Necesitamos valor para ir en contra nuestros miedos, para dominar nuestros miedos, para vivir la vida moral hasta la plenitud. Necesitamos este don de fortaleza y valor para resistir miedo. Next is reverence or pi um, excuse me, piety, which we can also think of as reverence, um, which comes especially in prayer and worship. So when we worship, we want to do that from the heart and in a reverent way towards the Lord, respecting things that are sacred. Y luego viene piedad, que, que es reverencia, eh, especialmente en nuestra oración y alabanza o y adoración. Queremos hacerlo con reverencia por las cosas de Dios, ¿sí? por la sagradidad de las cosas de Dios. Eh, next comes fear of the Lord, which we sometimes call instead wonder and awe. And it's not a servile fear, but rather it's like the fear of being separated from your parents. If you're a child and you go to a concert or a gathering of people and you could get lost in the crowd and that's a scary feeling and it feels good to stay with them and you want to be protected close to your parents. The same way, we don't want to be separated from God by the devil, the world, the flesh, or sin. That we should have a fear of that, but we want to stay close to God. Viene, luego viene como miedo del Señor. Es decir, no como un miedo, como una persona tan, tan tímido. No, es, eh, distinto de eso es como um, que, eh, no, damos cuenta que en la grandeza del Señor nos hace sentir pequeña a, 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 a hablar de Él, ¿verdad? También un miedo de ser separado del Señor. Como un niño que va a una muchedumbre, un evento, él tiene miedo de separarse de sus padres. Igual debemos tener ese miedo de separarnos de nuestro Padre Celestial por pecado o la carne o el diablo que quiere separarnos y nosotros queremos estar cerca del Señor. Muy bien. So those are just a rundown of, and maybe a little further explanation of the gifts of the Holy Spirit. 
I'm going to give you some um, explanation of the fruits, but I won't go too deeply into it because um, some of them are kind of like self-explanatory, but I just want to put them up there just so you have a chance to see what are the 12 fruits of the Holy Spirit. So I'm going to do that now. And again, I'll bring that close to the screen so we can kind of look at that together, okay? So let's do that. So we're just going to see the fruits of the Holy Spirit, modesty, patience, peace, chastity, goodness, gentleness, faithfulness, self-control, charity, joy, generosity, kindness. And those are the fruits of the Holy Spirit, okay? So, eh, los frutos, modestia, paciencia, paz, castidad, eh, bondad, muchadumbre, fidelidad, autodomino, caridad, gozo, generosidad y amabilidad. Okay, these are the fruits of the Holy Spirit. Well, so the gifts you saw, we had to do with things of the mind, the intellect, and also abilities to, that are needed to live the Christian life and to live a life of virtue. Well, if we put the gifts to practice and we begin to live and perfect the life of virtue and the life of the Lord, well, then what's going to start happening? These fruits that I just mentioned are going to start to come out of us. We are going to be people who reflect these beautiful qualities of the Holy Spirit. Um, and just to say maybe a couple words on each. Y si, si ponemos los dones del Espíritu Santo en práctica y dejamos el Señor transformarnos desde adentro, vamos a tener como más virtudes y vivir una vida más virtuoso y gracias a Dios. Y cuando vivimos esta vida del Señor por el poder del Espíritu Santo, ya va a producir frutos del Espíritu Santo en nosotros. Eh, eh, como un árbol que tiene sus raíces, así que de, de un, un buen fuente de agua, pues eh, está siempre, eh, siempre fructificando, fructificoso, su, sus ramas da fruto que, que da como un placer a los que puede comer. And it's like the tree that's near the running waters that keeps its roots deep into them. Its branches can give fruits that give pleasure to those who have to eat them. So the same thing will be for us if we really let the gifts of the Holy Spirit work in us, we'll start to produce these fruits. Okay, un poco palabras sobre ellos. Modesty. Um, this is something I think that's kind of been missing in a lot of today's culture. And we think of not just uh, modesty in dress, but also modesty of, of our own personalities, not being so, so boisterous and so full of ourselves. But also, of course, how we dress, to, to be modest, to save what, it, what are the private areas of our body for the intimacy of, of, of spousal union. And often that's ignored in today's culture. Modestia es importante no solo en la forma que vestimos, que sí es important, importante ahí, pero también en la manera que comportamos. Eh, eh, no sea so, soberb, soberbioso o orgulloso, eh, pero modestia es como eh, un tipo de humildad en esta forma en cómo presentamos, pero también en la forma que vestimos. Necesitamos volver a este tema de modestia y, y, y salvar la área privada de nuestro cuerpo por, por la vida de, de intimidad de, de esposos, ¿verdad? Patience. Well, I think that's kind of self-explanatory. And it's beautiful to meet a patient person. They put you at ease. Eh, paciencia es auto-explanatorio, pero una persona paciente nos hace un sentir bien. Likewise, peace. I think that's self-explanatory. Eh, la paz también es, eh, es auto-explanatorio. Eh, castidad. Chastity. Of course, so needed today. So needed. And not just in, in what we do with our bodies, but really of mind and thought and heart. That's where the Lord desires to dwell and He has to be in where it is pure. Eh, también no solo con el cuerpo castidad, sino con el corazón, la mente y la alma. Tiene que ser puro para el Espíritu Santo habitar ahí. Okay, goodness, um, which is radiates when someone is filled with God's presence. Y la bondad es se flojo de uno cuando uno es lleno de la presencia de Dios. Gentleness, gentleness. Gentleness doesn't mean weakness. And it's actually what Christ showed often to people who were um, in such horrible condition. And he was gentle with the sick and the wounded and those great sinners. He wasn't harsh with them. And so we can learn that great quality from the Lord. Y mansarumbre, también ser gentil con personas que están eh, her con muchas heridas, físicamente y espiritualmente. El Señor muestro una, una manso corazón hacia ellos. Faithfulness. 
oh my goodness, isn't it critical? We've had so many horrible examples of infidelity, not only in, in marriage or in relationships, but I mean to God's way. And God wants us to be faithful. And, and that faithfulness is a sign, it's a fruit of the Holy Spirit. Y otro es fidelidad. Y hoy en día necesitamos este fruto tanto. Que es fidelidad no solo en matrimonio, sino en nuestros compromisos. Eh, necesitamos personas fieles, especialmente compromiso con el Señor. Self-control, you know, to allow us not to lose it when we get angry, or lose it when we're in a discussion with someone. It can happen, it can really hurt relationships. Autodomino, eh, o como autocontrol, nos ayuda a no perdernos eh, cuando estamos en conversación o en discusión con alguien para no dañar eh, relaciones y perjudicarles. Charity, I think that's obvious, you know. <laughs> that's the fruit of, of our union with Christ as it comes out as love. Eh, caridad también es obvio, que ese es el fruto del, del, de la vida de Dios en nosotros. Gozo, joy. Is, is really important. In fact, uh, there's one uh, saying that says, joy is the most absolute proof of the presence of God. El gozo es una prueba de la presencia de Dios. And, we, and God desires that our joy be complete. Dios deseo que nuestra um, gozo sea, o alegría sea, hasta la plenitud, en abundancia. Uh, generosity. We notice the lives of the saints very generous. They give of themselves, and they don't think of themselves. They just give to others until they have nothing left to give. En la vida de los santos está marcado por generosidad. Ellos se dan de sí mismo hasta no hay nada para quedar. And finally, kindness, right? Which kind of blends in with goodness and charity. Um, amabilidad. Uh, es como una mezcla de caridad y bondad de, de uno que, que puede ver el mejor en la otra persona y no los defectos. And especially, I think, we see that when we look at the good in others and not at their defects, which is what we can all do. So those are the 12 fruits of the Holy Spirit. Esos son los 12 frutos del Espíritu Santo que Dios quiere que nosotros recibimos y ponemos eh, eh, primero los dones, ponemos en práctica, y si ponemos en práctica los dones, ya va a venir los frutos automáticamente para dar como alegría al mundo a través de nuestra persona. And if we put those gifts of the Holy Spirit in practice and allow God to work those from the inside, then the fruits will just automatically flow out of that. And that will, will make uh, our church grow when, the, when there are people filled with the gifts and the fruits of the Holy Spirit. It's delightful to be around them and they feed others and others are made better in their presence, made healthier spiritually. And that's what God wants to do with you so that you can be a person that bears the gifts and the fruits to others and feed and help the church grow. Y cuando uno está lleno de los dones y frutos del Espíritu Santo, puede aumentar, alimentar a las personas en su presencia. Y la otra persona se siente bien, se siente levantado, or, or bien y lleno. Y Dios quiere hacerlo con ustedes, que llenarles con sus dones y frutos, para también compartir con los demás. So la iglesia puede crecer así a través de ustedes por el poder del Espíritu Santo. We can do this through the power of the Holy Spirit. Now we will pray our novena to the Holy Spirit. And you can find that, as I was saying, if you go to our Facebook posting, um, it should be pinned at the, near the top of the posts. And you'll see there's um, a, an entry for the, the, the novena of the Holy Spirit. It's listed in English and in Spanish. Ahora vamos a rezar nuestra novena en el, al Espíritu Santo. Usted puede verlo en nuestra página de Facebook. Está ahí puesto como es también apegado al tope de los posts, de los donde está postado todos los, los nuevos videos o or, or como artículos. Y tú vas a ver, al parte de tape es en inglés, pero si sigue abajo, hay la, hay la oración en español. Y como les dije al inicio, que no es palabra por la palabra traducción. Y una noche vamos a leerlo aquí en español, otra noche en inglés, y viceversa, cada noche. So, si tú quieres seguirlo en español... Es, la versión en español es un poco más larga, pero está ahí para leer, para ustedes leer, mientras yo leo eso hoy noche en inglés y mañana para que lea en español. So this night I'll read this uh, first prayer, the first night in English, and um, those who want to follow along in Spanish can find it there at the bottom part of that first post. Tomorrow night 
Father Higgins will read the prayer in Spanish, which is actually a little longer. It has, a, it has like a litany in there, um, and among other things. Um, and then you'll be able to follow along reading tomorrow night's in English. We'll have a new one posted tomorrow. So that's how we'll do it. We'll go back and forth one language each night, but of course, follow along in your own language. So tonight we begin with the Novena to the Holy Spirit in English. Ahora comenzamos la Novena del Espíritu Santo en inglés. Holy Spirit, Lord of Light, from your clear celestial height, your pure beaming radiance give. Only one thing is important, eternal salvation. Only one thing, therefore, is to be feared, sin. Sin is the result of ignorance, weakness, and indifference. The Holy Spirit is the spirit of light, of strength, and of love. With his sevenfold gifts, he enlightens the mind, strengthens the will, and inflames the heart with love of God. To ensure our salvation, we ought to invoke the divine spirit daily, for the spirit helpeth our infirmity. We know not, not what we should pray for as we ought, but the spirit himself asketh for us. Almighty and eternal God, who has vouchsafed to regenerate us by water and the Holy Spirit, and has given us forgiveness of all sins, vouchsafe to send forth from heaven upon us your sevenfold spirit, the spirit of wisdom and understanding, the spirit of counsel and fortitude, the spirit of knowledge and piety, and the spirit the spirit of holy fear. Amen. We now pray in our Father, and Hail Mary, and in the glory be seven times. Ahora, rezamos el Padre Nuestro, y la Ave María, y la Gloria, y la Gloria siete veces. The Our Father and Hail Mary, we pray only once. Padre Nuestro y Santa María, rezamos solo una vez. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory, to the Father, glory be to the Father and to the Son and the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. An act of consecration to the Holy Spirit. On my knees, before the great multitude of heavenly witnesses, I offer myself, soul and body to you, eternal Spirit of God. I adore the brightness of your purity, the unerring keenness of your justice, and the might of your love. You are the strength and light of my soul. In you I live and move and am. I desire never to grieve you by unfaithfulness to grace, and I pray with all my heart to be kept from the smallest sin against you. Mercifully guard my every thought and grant that I may always watch your light and listen to your voice and follow your gracious inspirations. I cling to you and give myself to you and ask you by your compassion to watch over me in my weakness. Holding the pierced feet of Jesus and looking at his five wounds and trusting in his precious blood and adoring his open side and stricken heart, I implore you, adorable spirit, helper of my infirmity, to keep me in your grace that I may never sin against you. Give me grace, O Holy Spirit, Spirit of the Father and the Son, to say to you always and everywhere, Speak, Lord, for your servant heareth. Amen. Prayer for the seven gifts of the Holy Spirit. O Lord Jesus Christ, who before ascending into heaven, did promise to send the Holy Spirit to finish your work in the souls of your apostles and disciples, deign to grant the same Holy Spirit to me, and may he perfect in my soul the work of your grace and your love. Grant me the spirit of wisdom that I may despise the perishable things of this world that aspire only after the things that are eternal the spirit of understanding to enlighten my mind with the light of your divine truth, the spirit of counsel that I, may that I may ever choose the surest way of pleasing God and gaining heaven, the spirit of fortitude that I may 
bear my cross with you, that I may overcome with courage all the obstacles that oppose my salvation. The spirit of knowledge that I may know God and know myself and grow perfect in the science of the saints. The spirit of piety that I may find the service of God sweet and amiable. The spirit of fear that I may be filled with a loving reverence towards God and may dread in any way to displease him. Mark me, dear Lord, with the sign of your true disciples and animate me in all things with your spirit. Amen. Come, Holy Spirit. Come, Holy Spirit. Come, Holy Spirit. Fill us with your light, your love, your peace, your joy. Ben Espiritu Santo. Ben Espiritu Santo. Ben Espiritu Santo. Genonos con su luz. Tu gozo, tu amor. Amen. Ben Espiritu Santo. Praise you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Praise you, Jesus. Thank you, Spirit. Praise you, Spirit. Praise you, Spirit. Alabanzas. Gloria alabanzas, Jesus. Gracias, Señor Jesus. Te alabamos, Jesus. Te bendecimos. Gracias, Espíritu Santo. Gracias, Espíritu Santo. Ven, Espíritu Santo. Ven, Espíritu Santo. Renuevanos. Purificanos. Lávanos. Báñanos con tu luz, con tu, tu amor, tu paz. Renuevanos. Renew us, Holy Spirit. Come, Holy Spirit. Come, Holy Spirit. Fill us now with your light, your love, your joy. Renew us. Strengthen us. Heal us. Come, Holy Spirit. Ven, Espíritu Santo. Open our hearts. Open wide our hearts. Abre nuestros corazones, Espíritu Santo. Ven, Espíritu Santo. Ven, Espíritu Santo. Come, Holy Spirit. Come, Holy Spirit. Come into their hearts this night. Come into their minds this night. Come, Holy Spirit, fill their memories, their minds, their emotions, their entire being with your holy presence. Ven, Espíritu Santo, llena sus mentes, sus memorias, sus emociones, sus corazones, su, su, su todo ser con su presencia. Come, Holy Spirit. We receive you, Holy Spirit. We receive you. Te recibimos, Espíritu Santo. Te recibimos. Spiritu Santo, ven Espíritu Santo, ven Espíritu Santo, ven Espíritu Santo, Ruha, 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 Tantum mergo sacramentum venere mocenui et anticum documentum no voce dat ritui, prestet fides supplementum, sensum de effectui, genitori genitoque, laus et jubilatio, salus honor virtus quoque, Sitat benedictio, procendenti abut proque, comparsit laudatio. Amen. Bendito, bendito, bendito sea Dios, los ángeles cantan y alaban a Dios. Los ángeles cantan y alaban a Dios. Bendito, bendito, bendito sea Dios. Los ángeles cantan y alaban a Dios. 
los ángeles cantan y alaban a Dios. No dice Señor el pan del cielo, que en sí contiene todas las delicias. Oremos. Oh Dios, que en este sacramento admirable nos te haste el memorial de tu pasión. Te abrimos nos con seres venerados de tal modo, los sagrados misterios de tu cuerpo, de tu sangre, que experimentemos constantemente en nosotros el fruto de tu redención. Tú que vives en reinas con Dios Padre y unidad del Espíritu Santo, y eres Dios por los siglos de los siglos. Amén. Bendita sea Dios, bendita sea su santo nombre, bendita sea Jesucristo, verdadero Dios y verdadero hombre, bendita sea el nombre de Jesús, bendita sea su sacretísimo corazón, bendita sea su preciosísimo sangre, bendita sea Jesús en el santísimo sacramento del altar, bendita sea el Espíritu Santo Consolador, bendita sea excelsa Madre de Dios, María Santísima, bendita sea su santo Inmaculada Concepción, Bendita sea su gloriosa asunción. Bendita sea el nombre de María Virgen y Madre. Bendita sea San José, su castísimo esposo. Bendita sea Dios en sus ángeles y sus santos. May the heart of Jesus in the most blessed sacrament be praised, adored, and loved with grateful affection at every moment and all the tabernacles of the world, even until the end of time. Amen. Holy God, we praise thy name. Lord of all, we bow before thee. All on earth thy scepter claim. All in heaven above adore thee. Infinite thy vast domain. Everlasting is thy reign, infinite thy vast domain. Everlasting is thy reign. My brothers and sisters, thank you so much for staying with us for the novena. I know it's a little longer tonight. Uh, now the next nights we won't have to do the whole explanation at the beginning. Um, as you know, and we mentioned, you can just, uh, it'll be posted each day, the new prayer for the day on our website. So, um, in eh, todas las noches, ustedes pueden encontrar la novena, eh, la oración que está distinto cada día, en la página de, 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 de Facebook. And, and that's on our Facebook page, of course. Um, so, thank you so much for your graces and uh, God's graces and for accepting them and receiving them. Looking forward to this. Uh, just a reminder, we'll be um, putting up the link. Um, we'll be posting to the top of the page tonight and tomorrow. Also, um, our May Crowning Mass uh, that's going to be by Zoom on Sunday and uh, at 10.30 in Spanish and 12.30 in English. So you can find the link. It'll be on there. It's already the advertisement you'll see there posted down below in the Facebook page. We hope you can join us for Sunday Mass and also create your little crowns for your Marys in your home because we're going to have everybody... Uh, do that, and then we'll try to um, highlight and spotlight them at the time of the crowning, okay? So, ya vamos a pedirles para también eh, prepararse por la misa de Coronación de María el domingo. El enlace va a estar en la página de Facebook por una llamada de Zoom, una misa de Zoom con música. Y también vamos a ver cómo cada 
hogar está coronando su María, so prepárense como una coronación por la imagen de María en tu casa por esta misa de domingo. Okay. Good night, everybody. God bless you. And the Holy Spirit be with you.